Here's the story. On the first day of first grade, we were both held in from recess. Our teacher caught us writing nasty words on our desk and made us stay inside coloring pictures of mythical beasts. And that's when our friendship began. The year was 1984. And now, 39 years later, we want that recess we never got. But first, we're challenging ourselves to go back in time. We're gonna meet up at a park in Burbank after crossing LA in the cars and the clothes that we picked out for each other. Along the way, we'll complete some 80s themed homework assignments using only things that existed in 1984. And if we make it, we get to have our recess. Oh gosh, please don't be a stick shift. Please don't be a stick shift. Son of a bitch. Where would he put the keys? Oh, they're in the ignition. It's Link that left this classic sports car with the top down and the keys in the ignition here in beautiful Venice, California. I'm hoping that this is not my car. I know I've got a freaking, it's a GM. You suck, man. Honestly, this makes me feel kind of bad about the car that I gave him. Which does not go with my freaking outfit. I needed like a Lambo or something, like a Ferrari. <sighs> Well, it's, I mean, it's not, my knees are a little bit. If you get into a car and, and your knee is at the exact middle of the steering wheel, it's not big enough for you. Okay, so I got a lunchbox from Rhett and a couple of maps. 1984, you gotta use maps. This map is actually from 1984. And so is this one. Oh, it's been updated to 1984. No GPS today. GPS did not exist, at least not for civilians in 1984. And I've got a Polaroid camera, which will come into play. We have a few things that we've challenged each other with that will involve the Polaroid camera. Oh, look at this. My first assignment. When LA hosted the 1984 Olympics, the sickest event, judo, was held in the gym on the campus of Cal State Los Angeles. The heavyweights have the spotlight. There it is. Find it and do judo, do judo, in front of the kick-ass Olympic mural. Okay, and let's see the challenges that Link has prepared for me. Van Halen released their sweet, sweet tune, Panama, in 84. There is a Panama Street in Los Angeles. Go there and give it your best David Lee Roth. There's a fear of the unknown, what lurks behind that corner, you know? This is so gross. Look at this, it's like paper. Ugh. Do you say Panama Street or Panama? There's a Panama Drive. They changed Panama Street to Panama Drive as the years went by. I mean, Drive seems, it doesn't seem more modern or anything. Oh, I'm in Orange County. That's the problem. Wow, well, I don't care about Orange County. Give me LA County. There it is, Panama Street. You take a left on Pacific and a right on Washington, a right on Lincoln and a left on Maxala, then a right on Isla and a left on Panama Street. And that's when you know you're where you should be. What's the name of this street? Kearney Street. What did I say the name of that street was? Oh no, there's a Kearney with another E and there's a Kearney without an E. Kearney with an E. Does the horn work? Huh, barely. You know what they say about convertibles. If you roll over, it's all over. Okay, I believe that's first gear. Oh, shit. Colleges and universities. Cal State Los Angeles. Boom. The seven? No, that's a one. Did they not have glasses in 1984? Let's go. Oh, you know what? I gotta get, gotta get my tape out.
no Porsche. Does the horn work? Whoa, that's, that's a hell of a horn. I'm have to keep this in my lap. I'm actually looking at signs, which I haven't ever done. It is not easy living in the past. We've got it so good. Our maps talk to us. How do you map and drive? I can barely see. I can drive on my thigh. I'm good at that. I'm off the freeway because I felt like I was in endangerment to myself and uh, Dylan here on the camera, so. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, boys. Oh, shit. What's that smell? Is that the clutch? Boy, oh, my butthole is so tight right now. Panama! <laughs> I found you. You could not get away from me. Two. Hopefully it doesn't involve driving. Find the Arnold mural in Venice neighborhood and show off your Mr. Universe pose. There is no stuntman that really can uh, double me in a uh, dangerous situation, so, because nobody has a body like mine. I'm assuming that's close to Muscle Beach. Oh! Look, 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 look! California State University, Los Angeles. Boom, baby! Yes! Beep, beep, beep. I'm having to look over my shoulder to back up. Oh, crap. I just freaking broke the entire knob off of the gearbox. Hey, what's up? Hi, how are you doing? Good, man. Were you alive in 1984? I was not, unfortunately. Okay. Stay cool. Can't talk to anybody who wasn't alive in 1984. Excuse me, do you know where the old people on campus are? No. Excuse me, sir. Yes. Um, you were, you were alive in 1984, right? I'm so, yes, I was. Okay, good. Oh, so was I. I'm looking for the 1984 Olympic mural on campus. Go across the parking lot, and you're going to see it's going to be right in front of you. That's yes! That's the gymnasium, and it's right there. Up. Is that it? That's yeah. it, baby. I need somebody to take my picture. Would you be willing to take a Polaroid of me in front of the mural? Yeah, sure. Got a lot of fruit and vegetables there. That's yeah, very nice. Super healthy. Here, let's go over here. There's a statue. I could be wrestling the statue. Oh, this is Billy Jean King. Oh my gosh. Look at her eyes. Thanks so much. You're welcome. Yes. Task number one. Finally complete. Yeah, see, I would win immediately. Don't beep at me. Can you get a ticket for looking at a map? Is it like texting? One hour parking. What does that say? Pay by app. I'm not, not allowed to do that. Here's my thinking on this. In 1984, this digital meter, pay by app, wouldn't even be here. So I'd just be able to park here. So that's what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna park here. Where's the beef? It certainly is a big bun. It's a very big bun. Where's the beef? Some hamburger places give you a lot less beef on a lot of bun. There are only a few Wendy's in LA and the general area of one between downtown and Hollywood is circled on your map. Go there and ask them, where's the beef? I didn't see a circle. You see a circle? Ah! I found a circle. This is not a race, but I'm getting concerned that I'm not gonna make it to the playground before dark. Uh, mailman, are you 39? Are you at least 39 years old? You guys at least 39 years old? You guys were born before 1984, right? 
No, I mean, no offense. Do you know where the Arnold mural is? Let's look on the walls on the side streets. All I see is some kebabs down that alley. No time for souvenirs today. Most of the time I come to Venice, I, I'll, I'll walk away with a pair of shorts that says Kyle's ass. I feel like I'm running out of time. It usually takes a long time to do things, but he's got that automatic transmission. This is dumb hard. This is so hard when you're dumb. Where's the beef? Now this is an idea. Make the steering wheel your map. Hey man, you know where the uh, Arnold mural is? It was by Muscle Beach right now. That's what I thought, but I couldn't find it. This is right next to Muscle Beach. Is this like, does it continue around here? Oh, there's paint. Oh, 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 I see an arm. I see an arm. Ha <laughs> ha, there it is. Uh, you can run, but you cannot hide, Mr. Arnold. Little window right into Arnold's crutch. The things that that room has seen. Okay, I gotta get photo evidence of me doing this. I'm gonna basically be talking someone into an alley, but I'm not talking a child into an alley. I'm talking an older person into an alley, which seems more acceptable. I need somebody to take my picture in front of the Arnold mural, which is right on the other side of that Jim Morrison, on the other side of that building with this Polaroid. Could you pull up and do that for me? Sure. Thank you, sir. Awesome, appreciate it so much. Are you on like vacation or? Uh, it's sort of a weird scavenger hunt. They're in the right place for it. <laughs> That's right. The single hardest thing about using a fucking map is determining exactly where the fuck you're at. And if you spill some coffee on it, Put that out. Well, I had to burn the map because uh, it's in the lyrics. So now I gotta find my way to the Wendy's with only half of my circle. Hope everybody in the Wendy's is okay. Green light, green light, going slow, going slow. No Wendy's, another intersection. No Wendy's, no Wendy's. Oh, it's right there. I see it. It's the one with Wendy's on the sign. I've never been so happy to see a daggum Wendy's. Uh, where's the beef? Where's the what? I'm sorry. Uh, where is the beef? Where's the beef? Like the hamburger? You're not familiar with the commercial? Where's the beef? Where's the beef? Oh, oh, you're being sarcastic. Sorry about that. I didn't get it. No, I'm being sincere about the commercial. Where's in, the beef? It's in our hamburgers. That's right, because your your hamburgers aren't made with grandmas, or I don't actually know the point of the commercial. So in 1984, there was a commercial that took the world by storm. Uh -huh. And it was an old lady, and she said, where's the beef? And it was a Wendy's commercial. Where's the beef? Oh, sorry, I have no idea. I was born later. When were you born? 2000. Okay. Is there an older employee there? Um, uh, sure. Anybody who was born who lived in 1984. Oh, let me ask the manager, she might be. No, she just said no, she was not. Okay. We don't have anybody right now born at that time, sir. I'm so sorry about that. Oh, no, no need to apologize. <laughs> Would you like to place an order? No, I've already eaten, thanks. Oh, you take a photo of yourself at the drive through window. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Where's the beef? Well, yeah. Have a good one. Thank you, sir. See, I'm making friends everywhere I go. I gotta pull over somewhere, I forgot challenge number three. Challenge number three. Find and purchase a pack of Big League Chew, the gum that let every 80s kid feel like they were chewing tobacco just like their favorite athletes. Big League Chew, man-sized wads of great taste and shredded bubble gum stuffed into a giant Stay Fresh pouch for Big League flavor and Big League bubbles. It's Big League Chew. We do not endorse chewing tobacco. Okay, so I'm just looking for like a convenience store, gas station. This is how you used to find gas stations. You found them when you were on the road. 
I got the parking brake on, but it's not working. Ugh. I wonder if this place was here in 1984. Hey, how you doing? Are you at least 39? My age. Yeah. My age and 30. 30? Yeah. Oh, how, are you at least 39? I'm 58. Okay, so, you, uh, so I can talk to you. Do you know if this place is at least uh, 39 as well? Do you know if this was here in 1984? Just Started. I came here in 1984. 84 was a good year. It was good. It was, it was, it was, it was, it was Tina Turner. <laughs> yeah, was right. Shit. Come on. Yeah, right. But this shopping center was probably here. Hello. Yeah, yeah. It might, it might be here. Could you ask him if they have Big League Chew? Big League what? Big League Chew. Oh. The gum. The gum? Yeah. All right, let me ask. Big League Chew. You got Big League Chew? They don't make it no more. Well, that guy didn't even know. If they make it anymore, but I don't have a lot of time. I feel like I'm gonna just have to tell Link that they don't make it anymore. Okay, we agreed to meet at a park in Burbank that we both know the location of. Uh, and I know how to get to Burbank from this side of town. I just gotta get to the major highway. I gotta get to the 405, take the 405 to the 101, take the 101 to the 134, take the 134 to the five, and then I know my way around Burbank. Well, I sound like somebody from that SNL sketch, the Californians. I am on my third and final challenge. I gotta get to that playground, but first, let's dance. Footloose came out in 1984. He knows I've never seen Footloose. You gotta find a crowd of people and let them know dancing is no longer against the law. Then start your own dance party. So I guess Footloose was about dancing being outlawed. I could have kept looking for the big league chew, but I wouldn't be able to make it to the park to actually have a recess before the sun goes down. And I'm gonna get there, I'm not gonna have the big league chew, but I'll be there, you know? He'll have me, his best friend. Hey guys, just wanna let you know that dancing is now legal. Time for a dance party. Anytime you want. There you go. Anytime you want. Little dance party. Little dance party. You, sir? It's 1984 again. It's 1984. Thanks for your cooperation. I'm getting on the most trafficked corridor in all of America in rush hour traffic. Oh no, I gotta merge. I gotta get over. This will put hair on your balls. Well, at least we're moving. I mean, this is not common for the 405. Maybe we're gonna have smooth sailing. This is why people were going nuts in the 80s with road rage, because they just didn't know what was coming. They didn't know what was gonna happen. I just feel anxious. I still feel anxious. Okay, my homework assignments are complete. I'm headed to the playground to have my recess with my buddy. Um, this was not easy. This is not as fun as being in modern times, honestly. Uh, I couldn't even get in my car without using the keys. Where are all these people going? I mean, everyone can't have someplace important to be. I've got to go redo the first grade recess with my best friend. This FedEx ground truck, are you delivering important things? This garbage truck, do you have important trash? These fire trucks, are you going to put out important fires? I refuse to believe it's all important. We are at the playground. Recess time! Boom, boom, boom! Well. Not here yet. Uh, okay. Uh, we barely got any sun left. I feel like this is all my fault. Actually, I feel like it's all his fault because he's the one who got me this car. And that's the main reason I'm gonna be late. This must be what people did before they had phones. Yeah, it goes the other way too. <laughs> How hard can it be to get here? I'm here, and everything's hard for me. All right, I'm almost there. It's just right up here. Oh, he's out there. I gotta find a. I gotta find a place to park.
What took you so long? Uh, first gear, second gear, pretty much all the gears. I got everything done with time to spare. Uh, and I wasn't driving a Porsche. Yeah, well, you know what? They're overrated. I did not get everything done. That's but good. it was a conscious decision to That's not good. get the big league chew. Had plenty of time, just didn't do it because I don't want to send a negative message to the children. I broke my gear shift. I wish I had. You are.